Yes, sir. Rise and grind. Back at you with another video with the Pull Up King. All right, man. In this video, we got a 2003 Audi A4. Uh, this is a convertible Cabriolet. Uh, it's a 3.0 V6. A little two door. We're doing a fuel pump. That's the pump, brand new. And the location on this on this particular vehicle. <laughs> I believe it got something to do with the all-wheel drive front wheel drive it's up under here right here to get it out get the pump out i thought it was in the back seat but it wasn't so figured out it was there so we're gonna go ahead and knock this out let's get it we have emotion man we have emotion, we have emotion. Yeah, yeah. Hey, with another we have emotion, 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 we have uh, we got that out. Now I done took out. This was already hanging out. I don't know exactly what it is, but it's like some type of bag that it got back here. But you get this panel back. Got some clips. I took them out. Two of them out. And we got this thing right here moving up and down. So it's basically many screws three screws there's one here in the front one on the side over here behind so we gotta remove that gotta get back there and there's another one behind me so once you get that up this is what I use to get those clips off to prime on that and voila it's the fuel pump right there who would have thunk it? That's crazy. <laughs> Man, all right, so, ooh, we got a lot of dust and dirt. Try to clean some of this up, but what we gonna do, we gonna have to get this ring, this snap ring, get it off, this lock ring. I went ahead and took off this connector right here. Remove that. Now I'm gonna squeeze this with both hands and get that out. All right, y'all gotta excuse the tight, man. This face is just tight as hell, so I'm trying to work with the camera and everything and record, but uh, you get up in there, you see that little tab? You gotta, what I did was took a flat head and got right up under there and pushed it up. Took both my hands and pulled it apart. All right, let's see what we got going on here. It's probably the same thing. I can't get up under there. A few moments later. Alright, man. I finally finally got it off, man. This thing was a bitch to get off. This clip, I ended up breaking a piece of it. Trying to get it off. But uh, now to get these off, you just press in these tabs right here. You press them in. The, that blue tab, you press that in while pulling up at the same time and those will come out no gas came out of these so I'm trying to clean this up a little bit before I try my best alright that's what we got now I'm gonna work on uh, getting this ring off I'm gonna tap it to your left with a pry bar and a hammer. So I put my pry bar on one of these nipples here and just tapped it a little bit and it started moving. So that's pretty much not going to be too hard. I gave it a few taps, spinning. 
got it off, popped up. Take that ring off. All right, so if you twist it, twist it, get the pump. To this point, you can see this return line. You're gonna have to remove it. It's pretty much like the uh, these top lines. Press in on the tab and pull out. And that's that tag. All right, so I had to get down here with the camera. Get my little scope down here and see what these hoses were connected to. And uh, so what I did here, this one right here, I cut it. And it's connected to the pump itself. It's still connected to the pump from the top to down at the bottom. So try to pull this on out now and remove that return hose. Cause I gotta stick my hand down in the tank to get that. So we got it to the point where, cause this is just frustrating. You really don't have to do it, but I cut it. But I'm trying to get to this here. That nipple there. Squeeze those tabs and release, open it up. You know, that'll release that uh, return line. I had to twist that guy all the way around. Cause that leveling. Oh. And that right there would be in the way. So you gotta make room. So this is the setup that I got. All right, so gotta put that that in attach it onto that and see that line is gonna go right here and just like that you wanna install it I might see if I can get it in but you basically wanna take this you know this same shape that same turn up you wanna make sure you do it the same way Line it up. All right, man. So we back down in there. As you can see, we plugged up. I'm gonna use the same gasket because it doesn't have a new one. You know if it's reusable or not, man. But it looks pretty sturdy. Damn, brother, uh, that's what I got going on. I notice this is a third nipple here. Not too certain about that one, but uh, we're gonna see what happens. Tighten it up next. Let's see what we got. Gonna prime it a couple times. Alright, try that again. They need some gas. It don't have no lock lock on it. And it's cutting off every time you fuck. Start it up and cut off. When you hold it in, it'll run while it'll run when you hold gas it. Gas shooting out of it. Yep, that's it. Fuel pressure regulator. Fuck. But that's gonna be it, man. Hope the video helped out. Till next time, the pull-up king.